Good news for Igbos as Ohanese Ndigbo selects a new president. It's no longer news that Professor George Obiozo have emerged as the new president of Ohanese Ndigbo after an election was conducted at Dan Anyu Stadium in Imo State. It's important to know that George Obiozo was a former Nigerian ambassador to the United States, Israel, and Cyprus. A former Nigerian ambassador to the United States, Israel, and Cyprus, Professor George Obiozo has emerged President General of the Igbo Social Cultural Group on Hanese in the Igbo. Obiozo emerged in an election held at Dan Anyam Stadium in Oweria, the Imo State capital, on Sunday, which is today. Yes, um, this is as other candidates for the position of the President General boycotted the election. The Board of Trustee members representing River State at Ohanese Ndibu, Dr. Johnson Omenazu, who spoke to newsmen at the venue of the election, declared the process that brought Obiozo to power as fraudulent. However, a lot of people have reacted to this news that George Obiozo have been elected as the new president of Ohanese Ndibu. Here are many of their comments and reactions thank you thank you thank you for listening to this news yes my people my people ha, at last Ndigo gets another president president general of Ohanese Ndigo worldwide that's a great news it's something interesting well it's um Hope is a uh, is a known person, is someone that we know, and um, is also a true born Igbo son. You understand a true born Igbo son, and um, is uh, an international icon, one time international icon. He has represented Nigerian internationally and uh, and on the world right he has gone far he has gone places he is exposed and also is informed uh, why you see Igbo people have great people great people but they don't know it who knows that Obiozo will emerge the in the Igbo general because all the why he has not been even be saying a word. We, we have a lot of Igbo leaders there that have been noising, you know, even before this um, election, they, before the Awanese in the Igbo election, they have been saying a lot of things that uh, if I am elected, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that, elect me, and all of that. But I never heard the voice of Obiozo. I never heard his voice. This is what happens to the humble. The humble hardly say a word. The humble is always humble and he keeps so much to himself. And you can see how God does his own thing. Look at Obiozo now. You can see how successful he has been. He is now elected the Ohanese Indigo General. Hmm? This is, to me, I will tell you that even without being there, I believe that this is a free and fair election conducted. It's very, very free and fair. I, I can hear from the background of, this, of the article that some persons are saying that it was fraudulent. Why won't they stop now? No, people are about, people will definitely talk. No election that that will be conducted and people will not complain and say it is not uh, it's not a fair election that it, it was fraudulent and all of that. People will definitely talk about it. People will definitely complain. I've never seen 
You understand? So it's um it's a normal thing. Let them talk. The most important thing is that it has been concluded, it has been appointed, it has been announced. So let's everyone according that title and respect as the Ohanese president general of the whole Igbo land. Well, um so much will be expected from him. Hmm? And um, is expected to do better than his predecessor. Nyangodo. If your predecessor did one, you are expected to do twenty times ten of what he has done. And then there is something I would like to leave behind behind for you. Understand? Um oh, Professor Opio. So you see, um I'm not criticizing the the past leader. But there is some things he did that which I will not even want you to even try to embark on because it really affected Igbo land in general. Even to date, Indigo will will will, will keep saying it and they will keep making reference to that. It's like an indelible mark. Please and please, you are the Ohanese in the Igbo, the mouthpiece of the Igbo people in general. You should be the one speaking on behalf of the Igbos. Please, I beg you in the name of Almighty God, don't, don't, uh, don't liars or don't um, have any, any, any plots. Or plan against the people. Don't dance to the tune of any foreigner. Your people should be your number one priority because they elected you. Hold their priority as number one. Speak for them where you feel necessary. Fight for them where you feel necessary don't deject them don't turn your back on them don't allow foreigners to take their belongings fight for them where you feel necessary i beg you these are the things i want to leave behind for you nian umudu never did this Nyan Imudu was a complete outsider to the to the Igbo people till the completion of his tenor. So these Igbo people will not want you to do such to them. Biko. Alright. So my people, my people, um let us all congratulate Professor Obiozo and um, give give him all the support that he will require for this um for this for his government all right please um my people don't forget to click on the subscription button as well as the bell button to get updated whenever we upload any new videos thank you